Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to Satisfactory guys. Thank you for joining me in another little episode here. Uh, this will be episode 9 by the way. Uh, hmm. I modified all those lines just to be for the call. Just to be a mark free. We get to 40 now. Uh, we're doing good with the call. Those guys are still getting filled up in there. This guy is apparently barely moving. But it's good, it's good. Made all of this mark tools in here just to work faster. Kinda sluggish, but it is what it is. This is how they work. Everything is nice and balanced. Those ones should run faster, but I'm guessing this one has an influence over them. In there is looking pretty good. The 19 here going up top. We're making in here our beams. They're going downstairs. I don't know what's gonna happen. Should I know? When that box in there is gonna get filled up, this guys are gonna back up. Uh, same thing with the pipes on the other side. So, don't care too much about those beams. I mean, I do care. I think I wanna. I wanna put some big boxes in there just to have those full and then put a Mars splitter in here, in there, whatever. Saying when that box is full, sink them uh, or something like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, in here, I already put one. Okay, so this one is saying go forward with the steel pipes. Once that box is full, take them out through here. Okay, because I want them in here. We're gonna use this space, we're gonna put a big box in here. Uh, there-ish, somewhere, I don't know. Yeah, there-ish. Uh, and I want those pipes stored in here. Once that box down below it's filled up. Uh, same thing, where this yellow? Oh, yeah, the yellow because they don't have enough ingots. Uh, although they should have mark free production post so guess why I was making guess why those were not moving like they should have been okay got it problem fixed problem fixed guys it's done we should be good now yeah, perfect. So I would like to do the same thing with the case beams. We're not making a ton of them. But the ones that we are making there are only for our own consumption. So 8.5, something like that we're making is going to take a billion goddamn years until that box is going to get filled up. Especially that we're going to go downstairs and we're going to put these boxes I still haven't upgraded our concrete production, so we're still lacking. We're barely having any. We're making something like 40. Uh, we're using something like 40, so we're gonna have to double that one. Like really soon. Uh, when that box with the in case pipes, in case beams, whatever, is gonna get filled up. I'm not exactly interested in saying sink those or keep them or stuff like that. No, that one is gonna be like that. We already have 265, amazing. But I wanna recover the pipes. So, this is the similar. That splitter in there is gonna have to become a smart splitter. And the pipes that we're doing in here, all those 60 pipes, I want them to come out from here, go around, merge with those others that we're making there. I don't remember how many. And get into that box and getting stored. Just to use them on top for the rotors, for the, I don't know, whatever. So we're making two, four, six, and a sixty. Yeah, that would be just amazing. That will be something like a 
supplementary production just in case uh, these guys are getting backed up. I think so. I think that is gonna be just amazing. And maybe we're gonna sink the final product. So let we are here. Let's let's take care of that one first. So I want I don't know. Can you replace a normal splitter with a mark splitter just by clicking on it? Apparently not. Okay, let's delete that guy. Make it a smart splitter. I think it was mark one. No, it was mark. Perfect. This one a mark one. So we're gonna say pipes, pipes, any, any, whatever. The left, oh no. So, why is it the mark two? I mean, we only have 60. Okay, let's continue with the trend because we got plenty of those mark two. Perfect. Who's gonna be on this line? Easy, bud. Easy. And here I'm gonna have a marker in front of this one and in front of that one going forward. I think that's right. Perfect. This one in here will have to become a mark because we're gonna have uh, actually mark two, but let's leave it like that. Let's leave it like that. So once our boxes downstairs will get filled up, they're gonna collect all in this box. Boxes. Two of them. And trust me, they're gonna get filled up, okay? Because down there, I'm not planning to make too much of a mess. This guy is already a mess in here. I would have liked to have everything only on one level, but I don't really like those in there. If I put a big box, that's gonna cover those lifts. Well, not exactly. But I'll be able to get rid of that belt going up to those lifts. So I was thinking to put one in here on the pipes and one in here on the beams because we are using a lot of those. But now that I think about it, oh, I don't know. I don't think I should do it. How many of these guys do I have in here left? A bunch. Oh, so that one is filled up. Well, what's going on with the plates in here then? Right? You're getting backed up, of course. You get it backed up, those guys are gonna stop. Uh, how are we doing with rotors? Because it's gonna be the same stuff. So, yeah. It's gonna be the same stuff. Well, let's take care of that little issue. This is a smart one, right? No, it's just a stupid one. Uh, that one and this one have to become a smart splitter. Let me get up on this. I really have to delete that one. So mark two going that way. Uh, it was a mark one. Okay, not mark three, mark one. Thank you very much. I need the small splitter online with that guy. Mark one in here. Any, any. The left overflow. So my overflow is going that. Good stuff. Same thing in there. 
this one will have to become a smart screw there. Uh, apparently this line is interrupted. Amazing. Yeah, because they're not aligned. I remember now. Gotta delete this one, otherwise once you take the belt, it ain't gonna work properly. Let's bring it straight up to here. And then like that. Looking very good. I ain't gonna lie. It's looking very good. I need it aligned with that. Oh my god. Okay. I think it is. It just picked up the signal, you know? So any to the left any is gonna split between that and that so i think so we had one going that way we should have one going that way let's check that one out because i might be mistaking here uh is it going through there or ahead through there it's perfect so to the right i want overflow i'm gonna put the simple lifting here like that gonna need the merger in front of these guys in here exiting forward and then merging in there what do you know That means all the overflow from those is gonna get synced. Let's test that one. Because I got a bunch of this in my inventory. Uh, now I really wanna make this mark too. All this under there. Perfect. Let's deposit some more of this in here. So, that belt is gonna get filled up. Pretty soon I'm at. They should come out through here. Merge with the extra rotors from there. Get in here. Get in here. Uh, we already have something like 70 maybe on this line. I would like to make it a mark. Three. Put everything into that box. Let's see how many are we gonna have there. Because at this point, this one it's a mark one. Just not to have this one going up and down like an idiot. But apparently we're gonna have to make it a mark two. Maybe it will be wiser to... Yeah, it would be wiser just to replace it with the bigger box. Uh, big storage please. So we're gonna have a mark free input, a mark output. Uh, that's gonna go pretty well. Pretty well, I'm at. Take that. Take that. Uh, that's about it. Give me those back. You can have those as well. Thank you. Good stuff. Well, I think it's gonna be just amazing. Of course, this guy's almost clip, but not exactly. It's gonna be good. That one goes downstairs to the production. It's amazing. So, we fixed. The possible, possible, is going to happen at some point. These guys will never stop here. Okay, they will work like stop. Uh, no matter if those boxes are going to get filled up. Because on this line. On this line in here. Uh, 
we have only this production. The one up top is going to a normal production and everything that is not used is getting synced. So that production there. It's gonna be just fine. The one below is going upstairs for the steel. Yeah, I think it's cool. Well let's see downstairs about the concrete, shall we? I feel like I'm missing something in here, but I don't know what. For sure I'm missing something. So the one below it's our first node that that is going to our normal production which all the boxes are already filled up it used to sink in here now it doesn't sink it goes upstairs and it's used at the steel production amazing yeah when i pick from those boxes we're gonna have issues with the steel but it's not a problem it's not a problem because we got a big buffer in there that can support a lot of abuse Plus, I have a few more stacks in there for rods, for, I don't know, plates, whatever. That's the only thing being made in here. And it's a 120, by the way. It's a Mark 1. The one up top in here, it's almost all used at the local production here. We're making reinforced plates 10 per minute with the wire from below. A part of it is getting stuck into that box of ours. Most of it is getting used in here for the stitch plate. They turn around this guy, which is doing our two modular frames per minute, enough for our needs. Some of it is going in here. Oh yeah. In here we're making the smart plate. That one's going downstairs. I need to put bigger boxes. Yeah. Uh, so it's good. And the third one that we got in there, actually we have four. We have four. No, we have only three. The third one going up top. I forget what is the. I think it goes is the first one that I put for the steel. And yeah, is the first one fitting the steel production. Now stop. And it takes something from the second one, the production down below. So we have two of them going in here. The coal looks very good, it filled up. Uh, we have 240 on that line. This one is filled up, it's just amazing. Apparently, our box with the pipes downstairs kind of filled up, or I did something stupid in here and they're not going downstairs. We are this putting something in there my god it's already filled up amazing <laughs> still a ways to go for those but it's normal think I going good things are going good in here apparently we only have quick wire and wire in there the rest is getting synced as it goes in if we have wire in there, means that our wire box is filled as well. Let's go check it out just to be sure about it. Yep, it's filled up. Amazing. Good stuff. So, everything should be balanced in there. Man, gotta love those lights. Gotta love them. I love them. When they're like that, oh man, it's just amazing. It makes my day, you know? My life is beautiful. <laughs> I live for this goddamn game. Uh, I made in here. How oh, should I mean? It's, look, in here. Double concrete. <laughs> Almost forgot about it. Let's go downstairs and do it. After that, uh, more coal for pipes from that way, somewhere far away in another galaxy. More quick wire. Uh, we're gonna bring more Caterium ingots basically. On that line in there with the uh, rotors, taters, whatever, and after that we're gonna need more power. So let's see what the hell are uh, we gonna get doing here because I put it the other way around. Uh, 
so I could modify this one but I really don't want to so it used to go that way and up in that box right now it's going that way and up in another box whatever uh, we're gonna need another three of these boys in here so if I put them in here I'm gonna have an issue with the distribution if I put them in here uh, I'm gonna have to modify all this crap in here <laughs> uh, I'm gonna put them in the back yeah why not let's put them in there <laughs> so this three are gonna continue the job in here <laughs> and we're gonna put some three more in here I just copied it one of those okay so and they gotta come in here something like that yeah one two and three because they're gonna fit from these boxes you gotta stay on the ground mister uh, you want more foundations here you go amazing I made it so that one has to go away of course because we got the inputs in here you know so let's make a lift uh, I need a merger merger going that way and away from this box okay so mark whatever that one is one <sighs> yeah something like that I'm thinking come on baby you can do this okay let me come next to you do you like that thank you very much perfect now let's fit inside these guys with that, first I think we're gonna have to upgrade this one. We're coming with 120, it's gonna have to be a Mark 3. This one will have to become a Mark 3. This one, this one, those can stay like that. Let's copy that recipe and put it into these guys. Uh, Marjorie? Yeah, why not? I'm gonna have to come into that one. That's gonna be something else. So how many? 13, 33. Jesus Christ. What numbers I have in here? Uh, so that's 40. With the other 40, we're gonna need an exit as a mark too. So now I gotta bring that one through here. Press that thing gets in the way. I'm gonna clip through that. I don't like it. Oh, apparently I can come through here. Uh, yeah, almost good. This one needs to be a little more in the back. <laughs> what if I bring it like that? It ain't gonna be pretty, isn't it? Well, in that case... It's gonna have to be like that. We're gonna have to live with this. <laughs> no. We don't have to live with that shit. We can make it a little bit. Okay. Let's try it again. Take two. Amazing, isn't it? <laughs> okay. Uh, power to these guys. Let's not upgrade to. Let's not forget to upgrade our miner. Okay. <laughs> Where the hell was that miner? I think it was poking through the floor somewhere. Mm -hmm. So it's a Mark 1. Okay, you're gonna have to become Mark 2, mister. Now, to do that, 
we're gonna need to put in here another miner. <laughs> I barely have everything I need to make it to mark. You know? No, I'm missing 10 encased beams. Amazing. Let's get up top. I really have to put some railings in here. <laughs> At some point. At some point. Not exactly now. Give me a hundred of those. Thank you very much. But now you can keep the rest. Let's get down there better and see about those lifts. How? Oh, it's straight in your mouth. Okay. Become a Mark II. That one becomes Mark III. You're gonna make the 40. Life is gonna be beautiful. Everybody's gonna love you. Let's take care of that little power issue that we're gonna have in here. Where are these guys connected in the front? Okay. Well, one of you is gonna be enough. I think it's, I think it's done. Won't you? Those guys will get what they need in there. Uh, I did make that one mark free, so it's just amazing. Uh, let's make those mark too, just to have things moving in here, like yesterday. You know, this one will get filled first. Uh, okay, so we got 40 and 40, 80. 40 comes to here, 40 comes to there. That one will have to become a mark too. All of it. Even this little part. And even this miner will have to become a mark too. And they'll have to get up top in there some. Well, I just invented something on number zero in here. Which is gonna help me do that real fast. Perfect. It's a Mark II. It's going in here. Uh, are you serious? I'm not able to go on that. Oh, that's so disappointing. So, is it a Mark II? It is. Well. Let's, uh, let's put an X in here. So, I did the first one of my text tasks did you did the first one of your tasks i don't know maybe you did it thank you if you did it so once that guy is getting filled up down there with beams we're gonna have our pipe in here oh, amazing we're gonna need a bunch of these pipes I'm telling you a bunch. Uh, one thing that I'm still missing that I forgot to do is to get down there. Let's put another like saw in here, you know? Uh, whatever. I don't know how far I gotta be in here, maybe. Yeah, something like that. Did I put it underneath? Jesus Christ. Okay. And I gotta check those boxes. These boxes. Uh, yeah. Still going strong in here. Perfect. Be coming. Quick, 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 quick. Let's modify them. Pop. They have enough inventory space. Uh, uh, yeah, amazing. Oh, I made the simple one. Unbelievable. Goddamn unbelievable. Because we're gonna need them, you know? 
Come on, baby. You can do this. I don't see the line, mister. I think it's good that like that. Come on. Yes. It was okay. Good stuff. Uh, I think next on our list should be starting to make that versatile framework Majiki before going for more coal for this stuff in here you know because we wanna get to mark four builds faster let's see what else is gonna help us this is very good not necessarily for the storage but for those towers I think we can unlock this like yesterday, so let's just do that real fast. Push the goddamn button. Perfect. Milestone reached. Pioneers can now store excess power for later use and span power lines across vast distances. Stored power is automatically distributed in cases of low power output. You've got the power. We should start playing with this guy soon enough. Because I will need to put down more production. Like really soon. This is gonna be very useful because um, we're gonna have to bring in here or build, some, for example, keep its place. Okay, we got in there uh, six pure iron nodes. Guess where I'm gonna do our motor factory? In there. Guess where I'm gonna do modular frames fact. In there. Okay, because these two that we're building here are very nice for our personal own needs, but that's it. Nothing more. Speaking with of what's gonna happen when the box is gonna get full with this modular frames. So that one will stop that will affect my iron line and we're gonna have more of those who's gonna sink uh, yeah it's cool or i could just put a small splitter in here and sink this modular frames hmm i don't know if that one is gonna get filled up um, that's our secondary line. If that one is gonna get filled up, the excess ingots will go on that belt and this, they're gonna be synced. So, now this one is a choice. What exactly are you gonna sync, my friend? You no, know? because if I leave it like this, I'm gonna sync more reinforced plates, basically, what this one takes in here free reinforced blades and some iron ingots not a lot of points in there you know but if i'm gonna sink those modular frames now that's a totally different story you know so i'm thinking i want to sink the modular frames so let's just put a split in there let's put a merger in here under that guy Let's try and connect them with the lift. Uh, it doesn't work. Okay. Why not? I don't know. It should work. But whatever. So we're gonna see here. Hit any to the right overflow. Maybe now it's gonna work. Maybe this guy is not aligned. I don't know. Let me up. God damn it. Yeah, it wasn't aligned. So, merger. 
in here. And it clicked. Amazing. So, time to test that little theory of ours out. I wanna see those goddamn frames getting synced. Any of them coming? Yeah, two of them are coming. So, let's delete that line. That will be like the box is filled up. We're gonna keep our eyes on this to if we're gonna have them on that belt. Because they should exit to the right. With that lift on that belt, get in sync. I think that idiot has to get filled up first. Of course, I didn't make it. What did you expect? Uh, come in here. Take six, seven, whatever. First, that one has to get filled up. It will surely get filled up. If not, I did something wrong. No, I didn't do anything wrong. So it got filled up. Life is just beautiful. We're gonna sink uh, Majigis module frames when our box in there is gonna get filled up. They're already waiting, uh, going in there, waiting. <laughs> They're waiting in there, all of them. Uh, it's gonna be a while until this one is gonna get filled up. What is gonna happen? It's perfect. <laughs> Just the way we like, it, right? Good stuff. Uh, now, I got distracted by that. And I forget what the hell was it doing. I said, uh, don't do the more call for pipes, do the versatile. <laughs> That's what I said. Okay, let's see about the versatile framework. What exactly do we need in order to build on uh, So, we're doing everything in here except this one. And then we're gonna get into the nitty gritty with this one. Do I have any more? Not really, no. Are you sure? I'm sure. <laughs> Did I scan one? No. Oh my god. I need more hard drives in my life. Gotta open satisfactory Intel and look whatever they are. <laughs> okay. Because I want to do the stators and the rollers upstairs in there and onto the next level. Hmm. With the Caterium and the uh, I mean with quick wire and with <laughs> and so build the motors in here if it's possible of course if not gonna go to Kibitz place that's it <laughs> but I would like to keep Kibitz place for the heavy module frames because we're not building those either uh, these guys you know it's all iron here iron concrete whatever iron iron iron, 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 iron. Just a little bit of coal, but it's fine. So, let's see about this, guys. It's taking one module frame and 12 beams. Are you serious? Only that? I thought it would have been more, more complicated. Well, our uh, steel beam box is getting filled up really fast. And our module frames box is getting up relatively fast i think this one is already filled up no not yet but it's gonna get at some point this one is the one that's filled up and the modular frames yeah we're getting there we're making something like a minute so 
what's what 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 rates do we have for this guy? 2.5. So we're gonna be able to make like four per minute, I think. Yeah, 24 still beam to moderate frames. Well, instead of sinking those lights in there. Uh, maybe we should take them up and use them. What do you say about my plan? A a blower. Yeah, delete that. Delete that. The uh, pipes are going from there. I meant beams. Where the hell are the beams? Uh huh. I shouldn't have deleted that. But it is what it is. I'm gonna take care of it in a minute. I think I'm gonna modify it and put it in here instead. You know. Better. So. A small splitter in here. Um, to the right is gonna be any and a heavy overflow. Okay, grab this. How high? This level high. But put it like this. The belt is gonna be straight, that's why I choose that. And now let's go down there. Excuse me? Yes, thank you. Uh there is the nasty production of those. Is it? Yes it is. Uh, so first of all, we can put him in here. Of course, I'm gonna have to bring in the beams on this level as well. The excess of beams, basically. So our beams are going in there, down there. How many are we making? 30, 45. It's gonna be more than enough because one assembler takes like something like 24. Uh huh. Okay. So they're going kind of crooked in there. Perfect. I'll have no regret deleting that belt. Let me tell you that. Uh, gonna have it here, small split there. How many were they? 45, mark one, perfect. Uh, to the right, any? Delete that, please. Drop it in there straight. Connect to the other one. Perfect, thank you very much. There you go, you're going, perfect. And now, Cool. Then I have to find a way to drag the excess from here down to levels, you know? Amazing, isn't it? Uh, hmm. Where, where exactly was that? In there? Yeah. Well, <laughs> it ain't that bad. What? No? It's good? 
I think it's good. I think we're good. Gotta get down there. Here. Forty five, was it? I think so. Of course. I'm still gonna have some discrepancies over here because it ain't gonna be enough. I'm not gonna use it all. So I'm still gonna have to sink stuff because I'm putting pushing up 25. But I'm gonna use only 20, you know? On the excess. So I'm gonna have an excess in here, even less. I'm gonna make 4 per minute, 24. And I'm gonna have 45. That means 21 will have to get synced. Otherwise, oh my god, it's already here. Are you serious? That means that my box up top is filled up. Uh, let's do that. Put it like in here. I need that curve, you know, that's why. Four of you, please. And at some point, we're gonna have it there. Those, uh, who whatever per minute in the meantime guess what all of this is gonna get synced that goes down below I have to come with these guys up and sink them from here amazing uh, way up in here on this level So the sinking is taking place in here. Where exactly is my lift? Oh, it's coming straight in this constructor. Amazing. Okay. So the sinking takes place in here. Uh, access from there. Access from there. It's getting through here. Okay. Delete this one. Excess from there will have to come in here. Let's put it on the floor. Uh, okay, let's put it down. So this one will have to do reverse time, let's see. That's gonna happen when we're gonna have enough modular frames in that box. Let me just go and check if my still being box it's filled up because I have some doubts I really have some doubts what the hell were they no they're not so something is going wrong uh nevertheless we got some steel beams going here uh what the hell is going on something went wrong with the splitter up top Only the overflow should go through there. 
Perfect. Fixed. Good stuff. Getting in there. Good. Now we're gonna have a bunch of beams coming in here. 45 per minute. Uh, we're gonna have a modular frames filling up this box. Two per minute. When they gonna get? When this one is gonna get filled up? We're gonna begin sinking them. When this one is gonna get filled up? We're gonna begin producing versatile framework. Two per minute ain't much, but it's fine. Let's see about that automated wire. wire ring status we are not doing those yet you know to do those i will need more wire and pipes well we have some excess pipes um Not sure I want to pick from those. Too much. Because we have sixteen here that go inside as fat uh, as long as I'm not taking from this box. Even if I take, I'm gonna take something like 200, so it ain't gonna be an issue. Because in here we got a bunch already stored. Uh, also, when we're gonna have plenty of reinforced, not reinforced, encased pipes, beams, whatever, we're gonna have the excess of the other 60 pipes going in there. In the same box. So I think we're gonna be cool just to make a few staters in here. Because we're gonna need those um parcels and for the versatile. Let's see. What can we do? I don't have quick wire. Oh, this is not difficult. What about the versatile? So I'm going to make five per minute, whatever. Uh, I don't even need staters. Oh, that's because it's not what I was saying. Okay. Staters and cables. Well, now this one becomes interesting. This one becomes interesting. I would like to have some like per minute. It's more than enough. Uh, 40 cable. Okay. Two staters. Good stuff. Yeah, you know, to have it here, two staters. We're gonna have six steel pipe. Ain't gonna be an issue. 16 wire. Okay. So we're gonna need 16 wire and another 40 cable. That's another 80 wire. So 80, 96, about 100 wire. And some more steel pipe pipes okay let's see what's the wire situation because i know we're sinking some at this point i mean you can see it in here going as i told you as long oh we're sinking copper ingots as well oh that's really interesting we don't you agree right Let's get down there below, see what's going on. I know we think it's something, but not much. So, this game makes AI limiters. We have a nexus of copper ingots. Only the excess is getting through here. Apparently we get some excess. Of course, if I start picking from those boxes, goodbye excess, okay? So, I would not rely on those. In here we're making what exactly? The copper sheets for the AA limiters. We're not gonna touch these guys. 
Now, this line, as you remember, I made it in excess of the other guys. So, it wasn't working properly. I came in here, put a small split, and I said, Priority, make me this. This guy is making all oh, three of them copper sheets for my own picking box. When I start from there, this is priority number one. X goes through here. After that, second line in here. This one, we're making in here a wire. Okay? That wire is going primarily for the reinforced plate construction in there. All of it with the exception of some little excess because we're making here something like 120, I don't know. That is going on this line. And on this line, we have another smash, which says priority my box. After that, excess getting sick. So I will not pick up from this box. This will go non-stop. Now the other remainder of copper ingots are coming in here just to make iron ingots oh jesus christ just to make copper sheets combined with the caterium that is produced only for this this is priority number one and after that it's my box to make the air limiters uh when the air limiters box is gonna get filled up nothing will happen to it <laughs> uh, i don't think i put something here that says sink them Ah, oh, thanks. So we'll have to keep that in mind at some point. <laughs> to do something about it. Yeah, it's going straight into our box. Amazing. <laughs> that's not a, that's not ideal. Let's take care of that magic right now because if not, it's going to become an issue long term. Things are going to back up. Uh, we don't want that to happen. This is going to the sink in here with that. Amazing. Uh, put the smart split in there. Uh, to the left, please put the overflow. Thank you very much. Grab the overflow. Bring it down here. Is it gonna touch? No, it's not. I swear it's not touching. Okay. Put that guy in there. And we're gonna sink the overflow now. Well, that means that my copper line is perfectly full, oh, can I speak? Perfectly balanced. I can make that one a Mark II miner. Put up some more Majigas in there. To work, but. Ah, that. <laughs> I don't want to take that excess nowhere. You know, I want to separate the outputs, basically. I want to separate the outputs for those guys. I don't know how exactly to do that. Because everything is set in there. <laughs> in stone. I think it's something. I'll play with, uh, with those. Maybe I'm going to put a lift from the first two I'll activate the, the second two batches so four of them they will continue fitting on that line in the first two I'm gonna pick them with one of this and bring them on top of that or something like that or just bring a floor from there I said from there in there <laughs> and take another 120 copper and bring it up top in here somewhere uh, another floor up where is this one here oh i don't like you in here mister we're gonna have to do something about you yeah we're really gonna have to do something about you uh yeah i don't know what nevertheless so getting back to the problem on hand how much wire? 9,100 wire. What's that in ingots? How many ingots do I need? Oh. That's interesting. 
a hundred, so I will need something like three, four of this, not much. That's sixty ingots, that's nothing. Uh, well, maybe we're gonna make more staters. Just to have something on hand in here, I think that will be wise as well. So, let's come in here. Uh, I don't know, put something in here. So, let me put in here some more tasks. We're gonna see here, uh, first let me copy this. I'm gonna say like this. 120 more copper. Okay. Uh, so we need staters for personal use. And automated wiring. I think that's the way you write it. Uh, yep, yeah. so status for us and automate the wire, and then we can continue with the magicus in there. Those magicus in there, I think we can delete this. And now, coming back to that upper, let's get downstairs and see if we have enough place downstairs. Don't forget, our steel pipes are up here. Uh, sorry, went to wanted to go back there. Maybe I can use that line and split it into two. You see, I've made this mark three. This will remain a mark two, will act just the way it is, and I will be able to come with another mark two in here. I got some space in here, honestly, uh, but not much. Not much. I'm not sure I want to get into this area this is like reserved for the special items nothing down below so no thanks that means up here do we have the space unfortunately not no it's already a mess in here it's gonna stay like this let's go up In here, uh, we could do it in here. Uh, we got rid of those things in there. What about in the back? I have the pipes in here. Can I bring the copper in a beautiful way? Oh, it ain't possible. I could modify this coal line to go underneath because it will go underneath this one. Pretty nice. Uh, maybe? I don't know. Should we try it? Uh, I only want... Yeah, well, so... Bring underneath coal in here bring the copper come up top because the copper oh no the copper is coming from there it's not coming from here okay got it got it got it got it got it got it, got it. yeah ain't funny mister well it's a good thing and a bad thing the good thing because I could split it in here, go with it that way. But that platform it's a lot bigger. So I will have to continue with this one. Wow, well, it's already continued in here. And put it up top. But not necessarily in there under the coal. 
just bring it in there, you know. Hmm, it smells like flowers around here. What do you know? It's amazing. Uh, where are my boxes in there? Oh, okay. So I will have to bring it some, like in here. From there. It's feasible, of course. Easy to be done. I think it's gonna be just fine. I think. And that way, if I make that one a mark three in there, I will not have to play with making double builds with. I mean, this one mark three in here. I will not have to play with double belts, putting up another elevator in the middle. No, sir. That one in there will become a Mark III. This one will become a Mark III. Just like we thought when we built this, that's exactly what is going to happen. It's going to become a Mark III. The Leaf Mark III, the Minor Mark II. And we're going to have basically double the copper that we need up there but it is what it is you know it is what it is and uh, i think i'm not gonna put a normal splitter in here i'm gonna put an overflow splitter that means smart splitter and it's gonna say give to this idiot as much as it needs the rest push him to the left now we're gonna have a little more than 120. I mean 120 plus these guys, you know? And we're not gonna sink the copper. I think it's gonna be just fine. Yeah, it's gonna be just fine. That's the way to do it. And up there, we're gonna build our stators. We're gonna build. Oh my god. I was certain I was on this platform. Up there, we're gonna build our stators and uh, some for us, some for the automated wiring. Picking up from these boxes, I don't think they're gonna stay like this. They're not gonna remain like this. Gonna turn them that way. One to three boxes in here, something like that. Uh, and we're gonna go with the production that way. Uh, we're gonna need to make some copper. I don't know exactly where we're gonna make it. But it's only three of those guys. One, two, three in here, maybe like that. One, two, three. The box in there, so. Uh, well, it ain't gonna be pretty. It's gonna be too crowded, so. Like that. One, two, three. This box will come, I don't know, in the back maybe? We're gonna need another one for the cable. Well, kinda crowd. Kinda crowd. Especially that we're gonna put an assembler in the end as well. Gonna have to think about this. Maybe it's gonna be better just to make another floor. Leave this space empty in here. Maybe. I don't know. I'll think about it. But that is going to be for the next episode. Good thing I've written in here what is going to be needed to be done in the next episode. Because I'll forget by the time I'll get to record this. It's going to be something like a week, maybe a week and a half. So yeah, gotta go and collect more hard drives. Jesus Christ. That's going to be quite a trick. I want my jet back. I wanted it yesterday. Anyway, enough crying. It's been a beautiful night because for me it's night. I'm gonna have to get some sleep. Thank you guys so much for being here for watching this. If you like it, don't forget to push that like button, subscribe if you wanna see more. If you wanna help me on my journey of becoming a full time content creator, you can do that by grabbing a sales membership. The mutt thanks you for being here. I'm thinking of being here. He's got six babies, seven. Make that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Never knew that. Now I know. 
So yeah, thank you. Thanks to all the members. Thank to thanks to all the guys that comment on the series and on the channel, of course, in general. I'll see you guys in the next one. I think we did pretty good today. Well, don't you agree? I think so. I'm satisfied. I'm satisfied. Thank you. I'll see you in the next one. Bye now.